Hello and welcome to Bible Quiz Time, the channel where excitement meets biblical wisdom. Today, we've prepared 20 challenging questions to test your familiarity with the Holy Bible. Each correct answer is worth 10 points, so get ready to accumulate knowledge and points. Before we begin, if you haven't subscribed yet, click the subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the like button because every thumbs up and subscription helps us spread the word of God even further. And remember, at the end, we'll have bonus questions to challenge you even more. After the quiz, share with us in the comments how many points you scored and what your ranking is. We look forward to hearing from you. Ready to embark on this exciting biblical journey? Let's go! Question 1. Who was David's older brother? A. Eliab. B. Abinadab. C. Solomon. D. Nathan. Time to think. The correct answer is A. Eliab. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, 1 Samuel 16 verses 6 to 11. When they arrived, Samuel saw Eliab and thought, Surely the Lord's anointed stands here before the Lord. But the Lord said to Samuel, Do not consider his appearance or his height, for I have rejected him. The Lord does not look at the things people look at. People look at the outward appearance, but the Lord looks at the heart. Question 2. Who led the Israelites in the conquest of Jericho? A. Joshua. B. Moses. C. Caleb. D. Gideon. Time to think. The answer is A. Joshua. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Joshua 6 verses 1 to 21. Now the gates of Jericho were securely barred because of the Israelites. No one went out and no one came in. Then the Lord said to Joshua, See, I have delivered Jericho into your hands, along with its king and its fighting men. Question 3. Who was Isaac's wife? A. Zilpah. B. Rachel. C. Leah. D. Rebecca. Time to think. The answer is D. Rebecca. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Genesis 24 verse 67. Isaac brought her into the tent of his mother Sarah, and he married Rebekah. So she became his wife, and he loved her, and Isaac was comforted after his mother's death. Question 4. Which prophet saw an army of chariots of fire? A. Isaiah. B. Jeremiah. C. Elisha. D. Elijah. Time to think. The answer is D. Elijah. Biblical reference, 2 Kings 6 verses 15 to 17. When the servant of the man of God got up and went out early the next morning, an army with horses and chariots had surrounded the city. Oh no, my lord. What shall we do? The servant asked. Don't be afraid, the prophet answered. Those who are with us are more than those who are with them. Question 5. What was Paul's original name before his conversion? A. Saul. B. Simon. C. Bartholomew. D. Matthew. Time to think. The answer is A. Saul. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Acts 9 verses 1 to 19. Saul, Saul, why do you persecute me? Who are you, Lord? Saul asked. I am Jesus, whom you are persecuting, he replied. Question 6. Which apostle wrote the book of Revelation? A. John. B. Peter. C. Paul. D. James. Time to think. Answer. A. John. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference. Revelation 1 verses 1 to 20. The revelation from Jesus Christ, which God gave him to show his servants what must soon take place. He made it known 
by sending his angel to his servant John. Question 7. What was the miracle where Jesus turned water into wine? A. Wedding at Cana. B. Feeding of the 5,000. C. Walking on water. D. Healing the leper. Time to think. The answer is A. Wedding at Cana. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Local reference. John 2 verses 1 to 11. Jesus said to the servants, fill the jars with water. So they filled them to the brim. Then he told them, now draw some out and take it to the master of the banquet. They did so, and the master of the banquet tasted the water that had been turned into wine. Question 8. Who was the prophet who challenged? The prophets of Baal on Mount Carmel? A. Elijah. B. Elisha. C. Amos. D. Micah. Time to think. The answer is A, Elijah. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, 1 Kings 18 verses 20 to 40. Elijah stepped forward and said, How? Long will you waver between two opinions? If the Lord is God, follow him, but if Baal is God, follow him. But the people said nothing. Question 9. Which of Jacob's sons was known as? The man who ruled Egypt? A. Joseph. B. Benjamin. C. Reuben. D. Dan. Time to think. The answer is A. Joseph. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference. Genesis 41 verses 39 to 41. Then Pharaoh said to Joseph, Since God has made all this known to you, there is no one so discerning and wise as you. You shall be in charge of my palace, and all my people are to submit to your orders. Question 10. Which prophet wrote the book of Ezekiel? A. Daniel. B. Jeremiah. C. Ezekiel. D. Amos. Time to think. The answer is C, Ezekiel. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Ezekiel 1 verses 1 to 3. In the thirtieth year, in the fourth month. On the fifth day, while I was among the exiles. By the Kabar River, the heavens were opened. And I saw visions of God. Question 11. Who is known as the friend of God in the Bible? A. Abraham. B. Moses. C. David. D. Isaiah. Time to think. The answer is A. Abraham. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Isaiah 41 verse 8. But you, Israel, my servant, Jacob, whom I have chosen, you descendants, of Abraham my friend. Question 12. Who is mentioned as the disciple whom Jesus loved in the Gospel of John? A. Peter. B. James. C. John. D. Judas Iscariot. Time to think. The answer is C, John. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, John 21 verses 20 to 24. This is the disciple who testifies to these things and who wrote them down. We know that his testimony is true. Question 13. Which prophet was fed by ravens during a period of drought? A. Elisha. B. Isaiah. C. Jeremiah. D. Elijah. Time to think. The answer is D. Elijah. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference. 1 Kings 17 verses 2 to 6. Then the word of the Lord came to Elijah. Leave here, turn eastward, and hide in the Koroth Ravine, east of the Jordan. You will drink from the brook, and I have directed the ravens to supply you with food there. Question 14. What is the psalm that begins with the words, The Lord is my shepherd, I lack nothing? 
A. Psalm 23. B. Psalm 91. C. Psalm 121. D. Psalm 139. Time to think. The answer is A. Psalm 23. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference. Psalm 23 verses 1 to 6. The Lord is my shepherd, I lack nothing. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside quiet waters, he refreshes my soul. Question 15. Who was chosen to lead the Israelites after the death of Moses? A. Joshua. B. Caleb. C. Gideon. D. Samson. Time to think. The answer is A. Joshua. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Joshua 1 verses 1 to 2. After the death of Moses the servant of the Lord, the Lord said to Joshua son of Nun, Moses' aid. Moses my servant is dead. Now then, you and all these people, get ready to cross the Jordan River into the land. I am about to give to them. Question 16. Which prophet saw a vision of a valley of dry bones coming to life? A. Isaiah. B. Ezekiel. C. Jeremiah. D. Daniel. Time to think. The answer is B, Ezekiel. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Ezekiel 37 verses 1 to 14. The hand of the Lord was on me, and he brought me out by the Spirit of the Lord and set me in the middle of a valley, it was full of bones. Question 17. Who was the last of the judges of Israel before the establishment of the monarchy? A. Samuel. B. Jephthah. C. Abimelech. D. Eli. Time to think. The answer is A. Samuel. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference. 1 Samuel 7 verses 15 to 17. Samuel continued as Israel's leader all the days of his life. From year to year he went on a circuit from Bethel to Gilgal to Mizpah, judging Israel in all those places. Question 18. What is the smallest book of the New Testament? A. Titus. B. 2 John. C. Philemon. D. 3 John. Time to think. The answer is C, Philemon. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Philemon 1 verses 1 to 25. I always thank my God as I remember you in my prayers because I hear about your love for all his holy people and your faith in the Lord Jesus. Question 19. Which prophet saw God in a vision in the temple? A. Isaiah. B. Ezekiel. C. Daniel. D. Zechariah. Time to think. The answer is A. Isaiah. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Isaiah 6 verses 1 to 8. In the year that King Isaiah died, I saw the Lord, high and exalted, seated on a throne, and the train of his robe filled the temple. Question 20. Who wrote the Gospel of Mark? A. Mark. B. Matthew. C. Luke. D. John. Time to think. The answer is A, Mark. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference, Mark 1 verses 1 to 8. The beginning of the good news about Jesus the Messiah, the Son of God, as it is written in Isaiah the prophet, I will send my messenger ahead of you, who will prepare your way. Surprise! How are you doing so far? We have a super bonus question to accumulate more points for the final ranking. Bonus question. Which prophet called down fire from heaven to consume sacrifices on Mount Carmel? A. Elijah. B. Elisha. C. Micah. 
D. Amos. Time to think. The answer is A. Elijah. If you get it right, you get 10 points. Biblical reference. 1 Kings 18 verses 36 to 39. At the time of sacrifice, the prophet Elijah stepped forward and prayed, Lord, the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Israel, let it be known today that you are God in Israel and that I am your servant and have done all these things at your command. If you've made it this far, congratulations. You truly are a master of biblical knowledge. Subscribe now to not miss the next challenge and share with friends so they can join this exciting biblical adventure and learn together. Don't forget to check your ranking in our award stage below. There are three winning groups, Virtuous Dawns, Radiant Stars, and Legends of Faith. Check the description according to the points you scored and tell me, which group do you belong to? Until the next video, keep exploring, learning, and, of course, having fun. Take care, and may peace be with you all.